good morning at least it's morning when I'm recording this and I'm going to give you some information that I found helpful on how to get organized even if you have ADD now there's tons of posts books whatnot out there about how to get organized and they're all fine and good and you're more than welcome to look at them I'm gonna tell you if you do suffer from ADD you're gonna probably find them overwhelming at least I did and in order to come clean I need to tell you that I've not been officially diagnosed as having ADD but I truly believe I have it and in case you're kinda in my same ballpark I'm gonna have a link down below in the information I submit to you um, that'll give you a link to WebMD and it has something like 10 symptoms or 10 problems that may indicate you have ADD. Truth is if you're an adult like myself here's what I found uh, and then I'm gonna get to the meat of it but just want to clarify it so you guys will know where I'm coming from. Years ago when I first heard about ADD I went to a doctor who was supposed to be the local specialist on it and his comments were basically along the lines of if you've lived your life this far you either don't have it or it's not very noticeable or whatnot he really didn't listen to any of the things I said after that and he didn't really care he kinda had his mind set he didn't want to hear it and so I think I saw him maybe two or three times and then I quit because there was no point he, and, and my interest was not getting medication it was more what can I do to get organized so as I say that didn't work and I'm gonna tell you right now I'm gonna give you some places that you're more than welcome to look but you're probably gonna find the same thing out it's just not gonna be the thing for you I went to WikiHow, I went to eHow, I went to a lot of those online things and they're wonderful but if you have ADD and it tells you one of them tells you to spread everything like if you're talking about getting your home organized get everything and spread it out Lord knows if I spread everything out I'd lose myself you know that's why I want to get organized I don't need them to tell me that I got a lot of stuff I know that I'm gonna now cut to the chase and I'm gonna tell you some things that I'm doing that's helping me get organized and getting a con getting control on my life and my home and how you could do the same thing so what do I do number one like I said it's morning time what I will be doing shortly is going for a walk with my dog that is getting to be a habit strongly suggest if you're like myself and you find yourself not getting things done the way you would like which is easy to do especially if you have ADD get in a habit so in other words like in the morning my dog and I both know that we need to go walking so that's something that's more or less a given rather than trying to even think about it if you do it that way it makes it easier you just start the day and you say okay I'm gonna do this and this and then I gotta go walking and it's I've gotta go walking because then you get that done and see you don't have to even worry about that okay first off second thing is I do make a list now I am not like the technically minded the engineering I had a lot of friends that were engineers that would write lists and their lists were much more complex than I could ever think of doing and would never want to do it because it just overwhelms me and I'm not suggesting that sometimes you may actually physically write out your list you may just write it in your head either way as long as you can keep it you know keep a handle on it and, and in order to keep a handle on it if you're like me I suggest you keep it short so today what do I plan to do I've done uh, about a half an hour of doing some studying and training and some online learning need I plan to do about a half an hour more also plan to do about a an hour's worth of reading and plan to uh, do what I'm doing right now which is get some uh, information and content out there so I'm already sort of accomplishing a couple of my goals and then I usually have on the agenda to work on cleaning up my house and work on cleaning up my yard yesterday I focused on the yard I mowed the yard which doesn't sound like much but I've got a big yard it's about couple acres two to three acres and it took me a good hour just to do the 
the basics. I didn't do all the frills. So, you know, got that done. So now I can work on some other aspects of, you know, getting my yard in shape. As far as uh, me, like I told you, I'm going to be doing the walking. I'm also watching what I eat. Again, kind of getting in habits, which is something that for me anyway works. So I would suggest you get in habits. Like I say, make a list. Don't get all stressed out about your list. Make them loose list. What I mean by that is, I've said I wanted to do an hour's worth of training. If things work out in my life that I don't get to do an additional hour's worth of training, heck, I've done a half an hour. I've done some training. So, you know, give yourself credit for accomplishing something. Don't make it mountain. Make it a little bump something that you can walk across or jump across. That's going to help you, number one, feel a sense of accomplish and worth. And that's what we're after. Because if you have ADD, you got a lot of people that are telling you what you should do. They'll tell you that you should not have stacks of paper on your desk. You probably already know that. Yet if they, in their zeal to clean it up, take care of it for you, then you'll never find anything, really, because they're going to throw things away that are important and keep things that are not. So, you know, we already know we need to get organized. I'm just trying to tell you how to do it. So what I suggest is make a list. I'd say probably at most have five things on your list. You can have a loose list as I do, because I'm going to do training. I'm going to do reading. I'm going to do exercise. I've got some errands to run. That's, let's see, walking, uh, reading, training, errands, and then I'll probably do some things just to kind of relax and chill out my mind. Because if you have ADD, your mind is going in a thousand different directions and you need to take time to get your mind at rest. So those are basically the five things I would, you know, suggest to you. I'm going to give you some resources. Some will be things you should do, seems things that I found may not work for me. And, um, you know, test things out. Everybody's individual. I hope that you, like myself, can find some ways to begin to get ourselves organized. And that will help us have a better life overall, I think. So you go out there. You have a great day. Get yourself organized if you can, and you can because I'm doing it, and I know you can. So, take care. Have a wonderful one. Thanks for listening. Bye-bye.